Magnitude Source Connect is a family of products designed to accelerate, lower the cost, and reduce the risk of integrating third-party data into SAP Central Finance. This video focuses on three products within this family that relate to transaction integration specifically. Source Connect Transaction, the first of these three modules, specifically integrates the financial transactions from any non-ECC data source into Central Finance. It includes pre-built adapters for the most common commercial ERP systems, and also provides a universal API to consume data from any source, whether a smaller commercial ERP system, a custom application, or where data privacy or geographical restrictions may prevent access directly to the source system. Its job is threefold. First, to load opening balances for customers, vendors, and GL accounts, and then a historical load of detailed transaction data for a period of time, and then finally, converting into operational mode, where in a near real-time manner, it will take transactions that are posted in source systems and replicate them into central finance. As an example, let's take a sales order that goes through logistics and then finally the billing and invoicing process. When the accounting is created for that invoice in the source system, SourceConnect transaction will replicate that in near real time, typically 60 to 90 seconds, into the third-party staging area that SAP provides in their SLT interface. Source Connect Transaction will bring along important identifiers, such as GL batch number, invoice number, and references to customer and material. This will end up in the Universal Journal in Central Finance. And technically, it's doing all of the extraction and data transformations and validations using SAP Data Services. Here we have a customer invoice posted in Oracle eBusiness Suite. As you can see, there's a mix of both transaction information and related reference and master data. As a prerequisite, the master data has to be mapped properly between sources and central finance. A separate module source connect harmonization can help with this, or you can set this up yourself. Assuming the master data is mapped properly, source connect transaction will extract this invoice from all the necessary tables in Oracle Business Suite, do several transformations against that data to get it into the right format to load into central finance, and perform many validations against the data to make sure that debits and credits balance out, the document doesn't have too many lines to post into central finance, and many others. And then finally, it will load this invoice into the staging area, comprised of seven different staging tables in SLT, and then SAP takes it from there to load into the Universal Journal. This all happens within 60 to 90 seconds, which ensures that the finance team has global visibility to financial data across their ERP landscape in near real time. Now we can see this transaction posted into central finance. Here we see the transaction attributes, and then we also see the related master and reference data. I'd like to point out one thing, that Source Connect transaction is interfacing these documents at a detail level. In this case, this actually is a customer invoice document type. This means two things. First, you can now report at a deeper level. You can break down your customer balances by customer or do day of sales outstanding by customer across your ERP systems. This enables a deeper value of central finance itself. And secondly, because it is a customer invoice, if you want to take that next step into shared services and apply cash against this invoice, you can do so. This detailed interface is true for several dozen transaction types that SourceConnect Transaction covers. To gain the most value out of central finance itself and gain the deepest level of reporting and enablement for shared services, you want to make sure that you're interfacing at this detail level versus a generic GL journal upload. Because the transaction is now interfaced into the Universal Journal, it can be accessed by any means, including analysis for office as you see here on the screen. Source Connect Transaction encapsulates and productizes the complex steps necessary to extract, transform, load, and validate the data as it moves from source into central finance. Source Connect SyncBack is the next of the modules covered in this video. It picks up where Source Connect Transaction leaves off. In the case of a shared service deployment of central finance, many operations are now done within central finance itself rather than the source systems. This is true for AP payments and AR cash applications and other transactions related to customer invoices. In these cases, it's often necessary to write back to the source system to close out the source transactions. This is the specific job of Source Connect SyncBack. Let's look closer at the AP example. Typically, your purchase order, goods receipt, vendor invoice, and matching is still going to happen in the source system. At that point, Source Connect Transaction replicates the AP or, or vendor invoice into central finance, 
And then you pay that invoice out of central finance. And it's at that payment time that Source Connect sync back, takes that payment and posts it back to the source system and applies it against that source invoice and closes that invoice. Here we have an example of a vendor invoice in Oracle Business Suite. Source Connect transaction will replicate this unpaid invoice into central finance. Then in a shared service mode, the vendor invoice payment is applied within central finance itself. It's at this point that Source Connect sync back will detect that payment and write it back to the source system, in this case Oracle Business Suite, and apply that payment to that vendor invoice. This essentially will close that invoice in the source and keep the vendor balance in sync. A similar but opposite situation occurs on the accounts receivable side. In this case, the sales order, logistics, and billing or invoicing occurs in the source system, and Source Connect transaction replicates that customer invoice into central finance, at which point cash can be received from the customer and applied to the invoice or other actions taken against that invoice. Those transactions will be replicated back to the source system by Source Connect sync back. And again, with an Oracle Business Suite example, you see that customer invoice in Oracle. You see Source Connect transaction replicating that customer invoice into central finance as a customer invoice document type. And then you see the cash application in central finance against that invoice. And then Source Connect sync back taking that cash application and replicating that cash application back into the source system. Just like vendor balances, this will keep the customer balances in sync and help close out those source transactions on the AR side. The third and final module in this video is Source Connect Drill Down. Source Connect Drill Down brings a native Fiori based experience to drilling into detail behind financial transactions that came from non SAP source systems. There are two components to the drill down product. First, at the same time that Source Connect Transaction replicates the financial document into the Universal Journal, Source Connect Drill Down replicates supporting detail behind that transaction into a HANA data store right next to the Universal Journal data. This allows the supporting detail from all transaction types across all source ERPs to be located in a central repository. And on top of this common data store, Source Connect Drill Down includes a Fiori application that enables a user to natively drill down from a document in the Universal Journal to the supporting detail, as you can see on the screen. Source Connect Drill Down is valuable in those account analysis, reconciliation, period close types of scenarios where you want to understand more detail beyond the Universal Journal entry. This is very difficult to do for non SAP data sources, and Source Connect Drill Down makes this an easy native experience. Together, these three products Source Connect Transaction, Sync Back, and Drill Down enable several value points of the Source Connect suite, namely, near real-time interface of non-SAP source transactions into central finance, the write-back of certain transaction types to enable shared services, and also the drill down to detail for period close and analysis purposes. The Source Connect products implement rapidly, typically in 10 to 15 days per source ERP instance. For more information on these modules, the related Source Connect harmonization module and Source Connect as a whole, visit magnitude.com/sap. Thank you for watching.